South Carolina Governor Henry McMaster and the South Carolina Department of Employment and Workforce say you may be eligible for disaster unemployment assistance. Counties include Aiken, Bamberg, Barnwell, and Saluda. FEMA has also approved individual assistance for those same counties. In addition, Governor McMaster says he expedited major presidential disaster declaration, uh, and it has been approved, or he is expediting that for approval. Uh, your Meredith Anderson has a rundown on additional help. The expedited help is certainly good news for a lot of people who live in South Carolina. Take, for example, this house. You've got a tree on the roof, a tarp on the roof, and of course the yard looks like this. And this could really be any house in a number of South Carolina counties. The damage from Hurricane Helene is just this extensive. But we did get a lot of good news today about assistance coming in from other areas. We're bringing in an Air Force, but Air Guard resource from Florida. It's called a Red Horse Unit. It's a small unit, but it brings a lot of capability as it relates to what we need right now, and that's debris clearing capability. So we look forward to having those soldiers or airmen from Florida tomorrow. That's in addition to the 600 South Carolina National Guard soldiers currently dispatched across the state, some already in our area. Their mission has been mostly to help clear roads, but now it's moving to whatever individual counties need. Because our area still looks like this, the South Carolina Law Enforcement Division also has agents in our area, specifically Aiken, McCormick, Edgefield, Saluda, and the city of North Augusta. More agents are on the way to Allendale, Barnwell, Bamberg, Edgefield, and McCormick counties. The South Carolina Department of Transportation has had an additional 87 crews move in to help. That's up from just 60 yesterday. A lot of you probably have a lot of piles that look exactly like this and as tempting as it might be to burn this to get rid of it, that's not a good idea. In fact, you cannot do that tomorrow in South Carolina. A burn ban starts tomorrow at 6 a.m. Your best bet, simply do what these people did across the street here, pile them up on the side of the road. It's going to be a long process to get rid of all this stuff. Reporting in North Augusta, Meredith Anderson on your side.